uh, he had a little yellow truck, and uh, we delivered furniture, and I worked for 50 cents an hour, and uh, worked my way through school, and uh, he told me that this girl from China was the girl I ought to meet. Well, I had my eyes already on another girl, but when I came out and saw her standing there, he said, that is Ruth Bell. At that moment, I was in love, not only in love, something told me inside she'll be your wife, and I took her nearly a year to come to that same conclusion. It was right there in uh, that spot from that girl. Two weeks later, he invited me to go to hear the Messiah on Sunday afternoon. And I remember when I was praying at night. And mind you, I didn't even know the man. I'd just been with him at, uh, for that one day. But I just prayed and I said, Lord, if you will let me share his life, I would consider it the greatest honor possible. And um, fortunately, I didn't know what lay ahead. I wouldn't have had the nerve to pray a prayer like that. God spoke to the college girl, and she realized that her life's mission was not in far away Tibet, but in loving support of this promising young evangelist. Billy and Ruth were married in Montreat, North Carolina, where the Bells had settled. There, in the heart of the Blue Ridge Mountains, the young couple would soon make Montreat home for the rest of their lives. I feel that being a wife and a mother is the happiest and most wonderful calling in the whole world. In fact, even a little humble you around the house when we done that run with the Lord. Last summer, I was home in the Prince of Scotland, and he told me, you're talking about a person who being a divine uh, profession, a divine calling. And he told me that this little motto of fact that he found in the public kitchen over the sink. It says, divine service will be conducted here three times daily. Only I eliminated it three times. We found that it's a 24 hour day proposition. As the years passed, Ruth Graham gladly played that supporting role to raise five children in a Christian home, to kiss Billy goodbye as he left on yet another ministry trip, to play both their parental roles in his absence, and to welcome him home again. God had crafted a perfect balance. The youngsters drew inspiration from their famous father, while they learned Christian values and behavior on a daily basis from their mother. As a result, all five children grew up to become involved in Christian ministries. The Lord gave us five wonderful children, and all five of them know the Lord. And that's largely due to Ruth and uh, her faithfulness in witnessing to them. Ruth Graham is known for her kind heart, her generous spirit, and her endless patience. She has shared her love with Billy and many others. Ruth has a sense of humor, too. When once asked by a TV talk show host whether as a Christian she had ever contemplated divorce, her answer was, divorce, no. Murder, yes. True love comes from God. And I think that a marriage must be consist of three people, the man, the woman, and God. I have a very strong wife who is uh, strong in the scriptures, and uh, she has been a great part of my ministry.